Welcome to the Daily Prophetic Word for Saturday, the 31st of August 2019. My name is Michael. I'm the founder of Triple Grace and the Righteous Pass Movement Foundation. And today the word is a new shoot. The tree fell, but out of the stem a new shoot is growing, a shoot of spirit and faith. A shoot of obedience and love for me. You are the new shoot, a renewal of the face of old, a new growth where once was nothing, a new beginning on the narrow path, a new shoot. This new shoot is the restoration of the former glory, but on a higher level. The latter rain that will replenish, replenish the dry world. It is the green growth of the heavenly kingdom in a dark world. A restoration of the former holy times in which my saints walked. A new shoot. Prayer warriors in full action for the whole world to see. Miracles and wonders will follow them. Close with a garment of praise and lifting up the needy and helpless. A restored movement of my hidden saints that will rush over the whole earth to reclaim it for myself. In the spirit of Elijah will my altar of old be restored to its former glory. You are my shoot of glory. And this was the daily prophetic word for Saturday, the 31st of August 2019. The Lord has said that we are the new shoot that comes out of the stem. As he was the shoot that came out of the stem of Jesse, a new growth. Now we are following in his ways, in his footsteps, and become his shoot of glory. The tree might have been fallen, but a new growth is coming forth. And you are that growth and you will walk that path together with all the others who are awakening right now. Who come to the truth in spirit and in faith. Who will separate themselves from the world and from Babylon and who walks that path to the holy mountain, to Mount Zion, and to be raptured at the sixth seal as a remnant church, but not the old church, a new church, a church 2.0, a church that is modeled after the first Christian in the book of Acts, that share resources, that love one another, that support one another in any case of calamity, that's coming together to let their light shine into the neighborhoods, that will lift up the needy, the nameless and faceless. A complete new church, without church buildings. Wherever two or three together in my name, I will be with them, said the Lord. And so this new church will gather in houses or in any other places. And they will come together daily, not only once a week for, for a lovely sermon. No, they come together every day. And meeting to get empowered and after this meetings and after where they have uh, got a teaching about bible verses or read the bible or prayed or whatever they did together then they are going out into the neighborhood every day to do a daily sacrifice of love in the name of the father every day they will be seen from alpha by other people every day doing this righteous deeds because the righteous deeds of the saints are the white clothes that we will wear at our time at the base of Mount Zion. And with this white clothes, we will be raptured into paradise. A multitude clothed in white that nobody can number. Read Revelation. We are this multitude. We are the people who will bring in the harvest. Of course, also there are different ones. There are people who become elders. There are people who build a society of the rose, an assembly of love and righteousness. And these are the elders, always a man and a woman, in pairs, always. They will lead one of these societies of the rose. And within the societies of the rose, they will gather the people together in the great harvest. They will bring as many people as possible to righteousness. This is their work, this is their destiny and their purpose. Other people may become even state leaders or national leaders. Follow the link for, to that in our description box below and see what you can do 
become an elder, a state or national leader. Step onto the path together with us. Join our website, triple-grace.com. Join them. It's free. Use all the resources. If you have questions, send them to me at our ministry email, triplegrace55 at gmail.com. But step forward. Be separated from the world. Be separated from the churches. Be the mighty shoot of glory of the Lord. A new thing will be done. The Lord has said that. It will be different from before. But it will restore the former glory of his altar. The altar of love, unity and support where we all come together. For one purpose only, to advance the heavenly kingdom and to win souls. Because the heavenly economy is about winning souls and the beast economy on the earth is about making money. So our destiny and purpose is to win as many souls as possible for the heavenly kingdom so that the harvest is great and that we bring it into the barn of our father Yahweh. And when we then be raptured and we stand before him, and he will say, well done, well done, my true and faithful servant. Then this is our reward. And what could be better than that? I love you all so dearly and I hope that you will join us and that you will support this ministry. So into the ministry that our message can go through the whole world. Help the poor children in Cambodia. Assist our Jesus and the Children Impact Week. Take the challenge of a pure heart. If you read my comments that I put sometimes on YouTube, then you will see it is a shame what happened there. The challenge of a pure heart, we only received one person who took that challenge. One. One Christian out of millions. It's a big shame for all of us. A big shame that we cannot assist poor children, that we do not have any mercy or anything only because we want to hold tight on our funds. Money is more important than the plight of small children. I cannot understand this. And nobody can. And if you call yourself a Christian, you still have time up to the 2nd of, October, 2nd of September to take part in the challenge of a pure heart. The link is in the first pinned comment. Read it. And weep with me together about people who call themselves Christians, but cannot even answer, cannot even make anything, cannot even have mercy on the plight of poor children. It's very, very sad. But I thank you that you have taken part today in this video. And I know you will sign up at our website, become a member there at triple-grace.com. It's free. And also watch all of our videos in our YouTube channel. Become a subscriber there. Click the bell icon. Get notification when we get a new video out. And take part in the challenge of a pure heart. Have a heart for suffering children. Just take the challenge and see how far we are off from being an early Christian. It's a very interesting challenge. Please take it. Thank you. And thank you all who have donated and thank you all who have sought in this ministry to help us to bring forth more videos and to reach the farthest corner of the world. I hope I will see you again tomorrow for the next daily prophetic word. My name is Michael. I'm the founder of Triple Grace and the Righteous Pass Movement Foundation. And I hope you will have a blessed day. And I will see you again tomorrow. Maranatha.